So this is the second part of my reply video to Paul and I talked in the first part that painting was more than just an aesthetic object when these paintings were painted they were ritual objects and people prayed to them and they depicted something deeper something beyond just being a painting that they depicted a deeper human truth and for me that is what painting is really about is depicting something which is which goes beyond it's it as an aesthetic object and it and it portrays something more profound about reality in life and expression and that my problem with french painting is that it distorted our view of art and it actually made art into art and when art becomes art that's when it it starts to fail and starts to stop being what it should be which is a vehicle of, of portraying something deeper about human reality and I showed how my view on art was very different from the people I studied with um, as they all saw art as pictures while I saw it as something more profound than that and I still look at that see art like that today I think the greatest art has to depict something something beyond itself okay and so my favorite artists were Ribera and Velasquez and they all depict something very profound and it's, this is not just an aesthetic object and my problem with French art is that it turned art into something which was aesthetic and that's why we have all the different styles in French painting and they actually created the first museums had the salons and gradually art for me declined in its expressive power and the greatest French art is always expresses something has some kind of truth in it. It go and I know Paul talk, Paul is very fond of um, the more decorative painting, but um, and it also has it does express something beyond itself. So for me, painting has to go beyond just being a picture. And when it becomes just a picture or thoughts of an aesthetic nature, then it goes it goes downhill and that's a, that's one of the reasons why uh French academic art kind of lost its way because it start it it became all about itself rather than expressing something truthful, something about life. And the and the impression is brought that that um, that kind of life and truth back into painting, which it had lost. And but the th the thing about uh, the negative aspects which were inherited by modern art was this idea that art is an aesthetic object, and they look and modern art then became focused on looking at painting as if it was all about the aesthetic and so it became about painting becoming abstract and you can see in the in the, how you can reflect how art was seen more as an aesthetic object through its styles so in French art you have lots of different styles and then when it came to the modern era you have lots of different styles and for me that is totally irrelevant and against what true art is and true art is exp expressing something deeper something human and something beyond its actual nature of what it is so it has to go beyond painting and touch the emotions and so modern art went down an aesthetic road and I mean the only and what I dislike about modern art is that it 
it um, distorted the human form so that people were no longer profound beings they were like they became aesthetic objects or um, they lost their human emotions and um, al although this is um, this is uh, I wouldn't say as, as bad as a lot of modern art is because at least it does try to represent something beyond beyond itself but that self that thing which it represents is for me um, a kind of dehumanization of the human body and human emotions but at least it goes beyond just being a painting and so modern art which is with its intense uh, obsession with the aesthetic has led us to this so you have these kind of images which are totally have no profound nature about them at all they're totally superficial totally about um, the superficiality of art of the modern world and so for me this is where art has fallen it's just become um, a reproduction an aesthetic object a portrayal of humanity as being shallow and that you know there is no true psychological depth or truth within the human being or expression of any kind and there we go but these ideas were were kind of originated when art be started be to become itself an art object and when it did that it kind of lost touch of of what it of what it truly is and what it truly can be what great art truly is which is a deeper express expression of human truth and human emotions and human feeling and so you can see that if you compare this religious image to the Ribera religious Im image you can see how this has be this has become extremely aestheticized okay and that's what French art did and modern art actually continued this trend of seeing art as just a painting and as I say the solution of painting is not of modern painting is not by looking at art again as as a as a painting although there are lots of merits in that but it is actually going back to nature drawing and the, the artist subjectively expressing some kind of truth and this will come through in their work as something genuine that is the problem with art today we have to get back to nature and back to drawing from nature as uh, the basis of art and trying to express something more profound and some kind of truth okay thanks